Third Speaker of the House of Representatives. The prayer will be offered by the guest chaplain, Rabbi Jimmy Kessler, of the Cong Congregation B'nai Israel of Galveston, Texas. When my grandparents, Saul Aaron Pincus Kessler, Fred Nussenblatt, and Ralph Hoffman fled inhuman treatment in Europe, I wonder what their prayers would be this day. Surely standing in this hallowed place inspires my deepest gratitude for their courage and faith and for the freedom and strength of our great nation. Moreover, though it may be routine for some of you in this room today, it is truly an awesome moment for me to realize those who have stood here before me and to be privileged to occupy that same space. Cognizant of this precious moment, I have chosen words that I believe echo feelings shared by many of my fellow citizens, that in this chamber are 435 of the choicest blessings our country possesses. In each of you are our dearest wishes, our choicest hopes, and our sincerest aspirations for today and all the tomorrows. Please know that you carry in your words and in your hands our special trust, and by your actions and words, you bless us. Our God and God of our ancestors, watch over those who stand in this house. Keep them ever mindful of our expectations and the trust we place in them. Give them wisdom for their actions and grant to each of them when they leave this chamber daily the joy of being able to say that the words of their mouths and the meditations of their hearts are acceptable in your sight and thereby truly know that they are a blessing to those of us for whom they stand here. Amen. The chair has examined the journal of the last day's proceedings and announces to the House his approval thereof. Pursuant to clause one of rule one, the journal stands approved. The Pledge of Allegiance will be.